Happy day to you from Betska, the Guru Coach here at CLI. I'm pleased to bring you today's life and business coaching tip, which is to use coaching methodologies which work at the subconscious mind. Did you know that our subconscious mind processes some 20 million environmental stimuli per second? And that the conscious mind processes only 40. So you might ask, who's running the show? Obviously, it is that subconscious mind. We need to remember that 97% of our life is run by our subconscious mind. And our subconscious is 1 million times more powerful than our conscious mind. So therefore, as a coach, as a client, we want to ensure that the beliefs in our subconscious mind are congruent with the beliefs in our conscious mind. I'll give you a couple of examples. Let's say you as a client go and see your CLI power coach and you say to the coach, yes, I know I will succeed in business. So that's your conscious mind speaking. But your CLI power coach takes you into your subconscious mind and your subconscious mind is saying, No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't want to succeed. So if the subconscious mind is controlling our life, what's going to happen? You got it. It'll be a lot more difficult for you to succeed. Because what we really want to do in coaching is to have our beliefs around your success, your beliefs in your conscious mind, congruent with the beliefs in your subconscious mind. And only then can you move forward. Very important. I'll give you another example, a life coaching example. Let's say you go to your CLI power coach and you say to the coach, yes, I really want to work. So conscious mind, I really want my marriage to work. And your CLI power coach takes you into your subconscious mind and your subconscious mind is saying, no, you don't, no, you don't. In other words, your subconscious mind is sabotaging you some way or somehow. Yeah. There's so many reasons why you might not want to succeed in your marriage or succeed in your business. So once again, the beliefs in your conscious mind about succeeding in your marriage, about having your marriage work, need to be congruent with the beliefs in your subconscious mind, right? They need to agree and only then can you move forward. So The suggestion today is that when you work with a coach, any kind of coach, make sure that they can do that. Again, beliefs in the conscious mind congruent with the beliefs in the subconscious mind. And also to ensure that every cell in your body believes that you can succeed, whether it's in life or in business and or in business. Great. That's it for today from Betska, the guru coach here at CLI helping everyone connect with their own guru within.